Yes, you are most welcome. As we gather on this Holy Thursday, a journey into the Gospel of John, chapter 13, which is the Gospel used and read at the Mass today. And I take a few verses from it in the earlier section of chapter 13. Jesus got up from table, removed his outer garment and, taking a towel, wrapped it round his waist. He then poured water into a basin and began to wash the disciples' feet and to wipe them with the towel he was wearing. He came to Simon Peter who said to him, Lord, you are you going to wash my feet? Jesus answered, At the moment you do not know what I am doing, but later you will understand. Never, said Peter, you shall never wash my feet. Jesus replied, If I do not wash you, you can have nothing in common with me. Then, Lord, said Simon Peter, not only my feet, but my hands and my head as well. A beautiful section from St. John's Gospel, chapter 13. And for a few moments on this Holy Thursday, I would like you to reflect as I am reflecting on allowing Jesus to wash your feet. How humble the Lord is. I can understand Peter's remonstration, as it were, with the Lord. Never, Lord, never. You are not going to do that. I'll wash your feet. But Jesus said to Peter, you can have nothing to do with me or nothing in common with me unless I can minister to you, unless I can wash your feet. And Peter's beautiful response not only my feet, but my hands and my head as well. So, just imagine the Lord washing your feet, ministering to you. What a wonderful privilege. up your voice, the Lord is near. Yes, Father, thank you for the gift of Jesus and his ministry to me. How he cares for me, Father, I thank you. How he is my shepherd leading me to greener pastures. I thank you. How he is a light in my path. Father, I thank you. And learning from Jesus in 
how he taught his disciples to pray. I too pray with them, empowered by the Spirit. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Mary, you stood by the cross as your son was dying. We ask you to pray for us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and that the hour of our death, Amen. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, journey with me and bless me as I journey into the triduum of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit's love for me and love for you. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen.